Okay, this week's module is about the 1980s and Ronald Reagan and the sort of conservative counter-revolution, which was a political swing back to the right from the sort of left-leaning politics of the 1960s and 70s. Um, pay particular attention to the video activity about Reaganomics because that's what the discussion is going to be about this week. It is difficult, I think, in today's modern political climate to understand how unifying Reagan was. There may be some people who didn't like him, but I don't know of a president who he, at that time, brought together the left and the right and, in many cases, put forth some policies that social workers may not have liked, but the majority of the population of the United States was very supportive of them at the time. Now, he did use a lot of stereotypes about people that were receiving sort of some sort of assistance, and he was fond of the stereotype of the welfare queen, which is the idea that if a person using government assistance and making tons of money off of it and things like that, those have largely been disproven. It's important to know that that was part of the message at the time. Okay, um, This is a pivotal time in social work because you were had that political swing back. And we this is kind of what we see today, I think, in modern elections with swinging left and right in far, far to the left and far to the right. So I, I think that that makes a difference in today's world. But it's important for us to go back and understand this period of time in the social work field. If you have other questions, please just let me know.